Let's see if we got this thing coming out. We got some stuff under it too. Big bunch of stuff. Holy cow. Looks like something tunnels. Looks like there's just a huge cavern under there. But we got this huge cap. It's pretty cool. Now this is the piece. It has an eight there. Which I mean that's pretty cool, but I'd rather add something other than an eight, but that is okay. It's like a humongous ash type tree. Yeah, we'll keep seeing what we can find. Still working on that, but it's got a hole in it, so I'm not keeping it. But yeah, and then there's that one that's still stuck in there pretty well. All right, guys, we popped this one out, and it's actually got a spot on it that I also may have messed up a little, but it's probably unembossed, so. Yes, okay, good. Hoping I didn't bust up a really good one, but I did not. I gotta be careful in digging, but always check the insides of these things, these enamels. Just make sure they get knocked out fully, because I found inks in them. I found a lot in them, so. Alright guys, we got what should be a bottle milk glasses in like it looks like a normal bottle. Yep, cork. Oh, and there's another. Alright, I've actually never found one of these before, so I forget it's probably a common one, but some of these are pretty darn good. So we'll see if this one is pretty darn good. Oh, it's in there, even though it's really not. But I'm gonna take my time, just so I don't break it. Oh, it is an Omaha bottle. That's what I was hoping for. Let's go. Omaha cream type bottle, a Goodrich. That's an awesome type to find. Oh, this one's a broke. Something in Co. Can't tell what that was. All right. Well, we'll get back to y'all if we find more. There's also a huge cavern in there though, as I showed you. Way back there, there's a big crock bowl, but it's too far back. My shovel can get kind of through, but I'll have to break through a bunch. I'm gonna be digging on Saturday soon. All right, guys, see these two? We got two goofball bottles here. that we're gonna try to get. May take a while, but we're gonna get them out. Oh, nuts. Never mind, we're not gonna get that one out. That one is a rip RIP. Complete break. All right, I'll get back to you when we actually get these out. Bye. All right, guys, this is the funniest thing ever. You see that? I, ex I broke this bottle. I figured it was a syrup pepsin, so. And then I broke that one too, which is a California fig syrup, the Louisville, Kentucky, California variant. Um, yeah, it was funny though, because I was just joking about how I never break anything with the shovel. And, um, yeah, no, I just broke things with this shovel. <laughs> Not good things, but still, things that would have been nice. But, oh well, we just got to be more careful can't be perfect every time.
All right, see that drugstore bottle right there? All right. Never mind. I thought it might pop out. Change of plans, I'm gonna use the thing that killed the last two bottles that I found. And we'll see if it wants to be a murderer this time. If it wants to destroy many bottles or not. It's uh, pretty sure it's, yeah, just a boring one. Nuts. Oh well. Oh well. Oh, we shall find some more. Get back to y'all soon. Alright guys. We got another Platts Mouth Hutch piece. Pretty cool. We got a Spice Co. A King Cole flavoring. Extracts Omaha. I actually broke that one. That's the second one I broke. I broke one in this dump and then I broke one downstream. <sighs> It's unfortunate. And then a blob. But we're currently chasing after an actual croc that I think has actual stenciling, or maybe not stenciling, but like letters for who it's made by. So could be a super valuable jug. So we're gonna chase it down and get her out. See y'all soon. All right. Let's go. Let's go, guys. No way. No! There's one hole in it. I don't think that's new. I think that's old. Whatever. Still a whole jug. Oh, there's another one. This thing's more damaged than we first thought. <laughs> well see if there's any writing on it. It's not every day you get a pretty much whole jug. I thought there was writing up there, but I'm not sure. I don't know, regardless. That's pretty cool. Let's look at the bottom. Still got the handle, so pretty nice. All right, we'll take that, even though it's a little busted. Cool jug, catch you on a bit. All right, we got my first ever complete bowl. It's a uh, iron stone china from Hanley, England. It has a teensy bit of chip, but that's the first complete bowl. So that's nice. Other than that, we've just found our jug, so. Hopefully we can find more. We got that just right here on the surface, so. All right, we'll get back at it. All right, guys, we got some bottles here. I think this one's good to come out. So we're gonna pop it out. It is embossed. Washington DC. A capper headache remedy. Very nice. Oh, look at that. Dirty water mess. Cool. Got one embossed so far. Now we just gotta see what this amber one is. like it's getting ready to come out. Uh, interesting. Will it have an embossing though? Does not look like it. Just a generic chem bottle. Regardless, cool finds. We got part of a whiskey flask right there too. And then we found that jar right there on emboss. It's still a really cool jar. All right, we'll see if we get anything else. I 
right guys, we got something in here. Holy cow, this thing is heavy. I don't know what that is, but it is massive. It's heavier than like something like this. It's heavier than that. Interesting, right on the surface. I'm gonna keep digging, see if we pop something else. 